Our road tripping adventures this week take us just off of the freeway down US 19 here to Yancey County. We're in Burnsville today. We find a tremendous amount of great artists who live and work right here in this community. And today Denise Cook from the Tow River Arts Council is with us. Tell us about the artists here because they're not just local, they are world renowned artists that live right here in Burnsville. We have so many different artists that live and work here. They work in all different mediums and disciplines, but there's glass blowers, uh, potters and ceramic artists, all sorts of woodworkers, painters, photographers, jewelers, just, just about every kind of art form that there are. And uh, they are known, as you said, throughout the world. So when the world famous highway construction project that's been happening here in Burnsville wraps up this summer, you guys are already working on a tremendous art project that's been in the works as well. Tell us about the Gateway Arts Project happening here in Burnsville. Well, with a grant from the North Carolina Arts Council, we were able to uh, bring to our community in Burnsville an uh, internationally known artist, Jack Mackey, who works on public art features. And because we have a dark sky designation, which means there's uh, no light pollution, this, in this community, uh, Malin Community College is building a telescope feature that is going to be the largest in the southeast. Our public art features will be telescopes filled with hand-blown glass from our community that will light the skies. One of the largest one will be 27 feet high. Well, there are a lot of great artists in this community, and one thing that brings them together is, of course, the Big Crafts Festival. I'm going to head next door and talk to your neighbor, Ginger, about the Big Crafts Festival you guys have here every year. Thanks, Mark. Ginger Johnson is with the Yancey County Chamber of Commerce, and the Mount Mitchell Crafts Fair has been drawing thousands of people up here for a long time. Tell us more about it. It's their 60th year of the Mount Mitchell Crafts Fair on August 5th and 6th right here in Burnsville. Well, 60 years is a very long time. What is it year after year that keeps bringing so many artists and thousands of people up here to the Mount Mitchell Crafts Fair? We have a beautiful town square. We have over 200 artists here with any type of art or craft you can imagine. We have two days of entertainment, great food, family fun. You don't want to miss it. Don't miss it. August 5th and 6th. It is a sea of tremendous artists right here in Yancey County. Check out all of our road tripping adventures this week in Yancey and Mitchell Counties at the Road Tripping Link at WLOS.com right there under the Community tab. Road tripping in Burnsville. I'm Mark Cady.